got the Thanksgiving sandwich. No, what you got? Yeah, man. Should look good, dude. Stuff for the balance. Yeah, we'll eat that. We'll put the mashed potatoes on the side. I didn't want the mashed potatoes on this for some reason. This shit look good. Woo! <laughs> you excited? I've never been so excited over food in my life. I'm gonna enjoy this the way I want to enjoy it. <laughs> NHD. Do the mashed potato test. Ooh, thick, creamy texture. Bro, these taste just like my grandmother's mashed potatoes. Oh my god. Yo, this is so crazy. Uh, let me see what the sandwich is all about now. I know most of you are saying, why are you eating a sandwich with a fork and a knife? I don't want to be messy. It's properly seasoned. This is amazing. This is amazing. Even the bread got like little crumbs on it. It tastes amazing. So I'm teaching Emilio the modeling industry and the business. Now again, I wasn't a model in the industry long enough to know everything, but with Emilio's look and everything he can present to the world, there's a lot of guys that will take advantage of the skills that he has. So with that being said, we networked last night, went to an event where there's a lot of photographers, a lot of models, just people in the industry that can get you places. Now again, everybody knows it's a networking event, so it's not un uncommon to get people's numbers, Instagrams, and try to collaborate with them. So we end up introducing Emilio to a guy that owns a modeling agency out here, and he was extremely impressed with Emilio. So even though he exchanged numbers last night, you gotta remember when you're at these networking events, a lot of people high on cocaine, or high on drugs, or they're just drunk, intoxicated, having a great time. So with that being said, I told him, you know, hey, shoot him a good morning text or a good afternoon, and say, be eager to work with him again, pleasure meeting you type stuff, and leave all your info there. Even though he already has your number, full name, phone number, email address, and Instagram, and if you have a portfolio for a website, you do that as well. Doing little reminders the next day after partying with a bunch of people that have a lot of stuff going on is one of those things that you want to kind of keep it fresh in the mind because now he just sent him that text. He's going to remind him all day today of the shit that went on last night. So quick tips for everybody. Always try to help you guys out.